Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Better Life Blog and I'm Arsenia Chudosho. Today I will show you how to make bell peppers chicken stuff. So we have bell peppers here. We will remove the innards. As this kind of bell peppers mostly sell in the market bell peppers is same as like this so how can you stand in the pyrex if the style is like this so you will just find a way how you stand your bell peppers when you put up fillings what i did is i find a way how to remove the innards it's okay that you can remove the seeds but uh, don't hurt the bottom because this one serves as a holder of our fillings but this kind of bell pepper it's okay you can remove the bottom and you can use the head part to stand you see it can stand okay guys let's make this one first it's done i remove all the innards only one i used for the head to stand the others is all in the bottom because if it's in the head we use the head to stand it's more easy to remove the innards but uh, if the bottom we choose to stand it's a little bit hard to remove the innards but be patient to remove it i use tools just to remove the innards with a small knife a small spoon a scissor and even a big knife just be careful not to hurt the bottom line okay let's start cooking guys in the deep casserole, we will boil water and we will put one chicken bouillon. We will wait for this to boil. It's boiling now guys, our water. So we need to put this uh, green bell papers there for 3 to 4 minutes. Every time we turn our bell papers to so the other side, we will go down and it will be boiled also. After 3 to 4 minutes, we need to turn our bell papers. It's just so easy to turn. So we will wait another 3 to 4 minutes again. It's done now guys. So we need to remove our bell peppers. But for our uh, bell peppers uh, broth, don't throw it. Just sit aside. We can use it later. While we are preparing for our, for our other ingredients, we must preheat our oven to 180 Celsius. So we have added ingredients here. Chopped onions dice green pepper chicken burger i crush it pasta sauce minced garlic half boiled rice minced chicken breast 
boiled peppers. I have also here the mixture of cheddar and mozzarella cheese and another one I separate for toppings. We will use also spices like oregano. Italian herbs, basil, chili powder, black pepper, half chicken bouillon, and salt. So let's begin cooking guys. It's ready now our pan. We will put a little olive oil. We will add our onion. Our onion is translucent now, so we will add our garlic. We will put our garlic and onion in one side. We will add our mint chicken. Then we will push our chicken again, another side. By this time, we will put our minced chicken burger. And then we will incorporate all our ingredients. We will add Italian herbs. Oregano. Basil. Next is our green pepper rice. And then we will add in the pan our half cooked rice.
we will put some of our seed aside broth of our green paper we will cover for the meantime let's check now guys our chicken mixture by this time we will add our half bouillon chicken I will add a little amount of chili powder. It's up to you guys. If uh, you are spicy, you can add the chili powder. By this time, we can add our pasta sauce. And our mozzarella and cheddar cheese. You can add more pasta sauce if you want. I will add chopped parsley Here it is now our chicken stuffing. So what we'll do, we will use a fork to stuff in the bell peppers. So it's ready to bake now guys, our bell peppers. We will bake this one for 25 minutes. But before baking, we will cover this one with aluminum foil. After 25 minutes guys, we will remove our bell peppers in the oven and then we will sprinkle with our cheese, mozzarella and the cheddar cheese. And then we will put this one back in the oven to broil for 3 minutes. Here it is now guys, our bell peppers stuffed with chicken. Mmm, so yummy. Hope you enjoyed viewing. Don't forget to subscribe, get a like, like. Thank you and God bless.